Let's talk a little bit more about Herbalife, Matt. The company reported fourth quarter profits that beat analyst forecasts on the company's call earlier. What struck me is that investors and executives, they were so focused on the results and not so much on this high profile battle between Carl Icahn and Bill Ackman. In fact, I didn't hear one question on the recent onslaught of attention until midway through the analyst questions when it came up pretty briefly. Take a listen here to what the CEO's response was when asked about this recent long investor. We all know who that is, Mr. Carl Icahn. We don't, and you wouldn't expect us to, I believe, comment on specific investors, but we, you know, will continue to believe obviously that the stock represents a compelling investment opportunity and so all the results we put forward today you know we we put that together with anyone who's legitimate um, you know we welcome them that are interested in learning anything and more about our company and yes we've had you know short discussions with with um, mr icon but uh, beyond that um, nothing concrete to report Okay, there you go. He said he has had short discussions with Mr. Icon, but nothing that substantial, nothing that concrete. One other point to make, it did come up. Uh, one analyst asked what had happened in terms of the SEC inquiry into Herbalife, and uh, the company's CEO said, well, in fact, we've answered this inquiry. We're uh, complying with all things that need to be complied with, and that's that for now. Um, I did speak with Bill Ackman immediately following the call and here's one of the points that he made to me that I want to share with you. He said they spent almost the entire call reading a speech uh, which they'd already put out in a press release and then they took one question from each bullish analyst then they ended the call. So much for transparency he said. He also pointed out that they have yet to answer any of our 284 questions and two weeks have gone by yet on the call the CEO talks about how transparent they are. So Bill Ackman really firmly believing this is not a transparent company and that they really haven't shown any good faith in terms of being able to answer some of these questions that he's posing to them.